I chose Project Go because as a cadet and you know in the future as an officer, it's important to be able to communicate and to have language skills, um, especially critical language skills that would be useful in Iran and Afghanistan. It is intensive and you are doing a semester every two and a half weeks and you're doing four of them. They can perform a lot of daily tasks that are required to survive in countries where these languages are spoken, meaning uh, they can make purchases in stores, they can order meals in restaurants, they can book travel for themselves, they can handle asking for accommodations in a hostel or a hotel. This is the best way um, to learn a language for ROTC students. They can speak the language as well as other skills, and I think uh, this is very crucial for them. And we've just been able to really get the next best thing to total immersion by being in class every day and speaking the language every day. For me at least, I feel like the best way to learn a language is to go full throttle, uh, and that's what we're doing here, so I think it was the, uh, the best option. The instructors are very eager to teach us, and they are always uh, willing to help us with everything that we need. They are very well organized, and they give us resources so that we can learn to the best of our abilities. We do Skype calls a couple times a week where we either just record our own voice or we record a conversation with another student. And that's been a lot of fun to have those recorded and saved because we can look back in the beginning and see how much improvement we've made. We do a lot of interactive activities in the class. Sometimes we'll go outside and play Simon Says in Farsi. We draw things on the boards, play like a Pictionary type game in Farsi. So the real life usage and interacting and having to think quick has been really helpful. During this one class we were learning about uh, how to you know, make food. So for one of the activities, the teacher uh, rolled out this huge roll of paper down the whole table and you know we were all writing down how to make our favorite foods. And then after that, we were playing charades in Arabic where the teacher would come over, show one side of the room a flashcard with a word in Arabic written on it and we had to make the other side guess the word we had. You know, when we do activities like that, it's really helpful because we are talking and working with other people. It's much more interactive and I like when we do that. Yeah, I never thought that I'd be able in such a short amount of time be able to speak so well. <laughs>